Kulumbay, Makobor, Nangtang Manang. Meghalaya, Raizini Fry, Angni Gasa, Garbani Fry, Kulumnai. Ar Gazani, Ar Gazangnai, Ko, Nangtang Mani Sim, Jasi Hormnai, Jabai. Gazang Thang. Honorable President, Sir, Jo Mene Abhi Boro Basha Me Mene Bhi Kaha. Usme Se Kam Se Kam Char Ya Paat Shabd Bilkul Mere Basha Garo Se Milta Junta Hai. Bodo language, Garo language, coach, Diori language. Ye sabhi ek jo hamare Sino Tibetan languages hai, usi ke bhag hai. Aaj maine ek word use kya, Angni. Iska matlab Garo me hota hai, Mera. To Bodo me bhi ise Angni hi bolte hai. गारो में एक शब्द है ना सोंगनी यानी कि आपका बोरो में भी इसे ना सोंगनी ही कहते हैं और ये ना सोंगनी और ना सोंगनी एक बहुत ही इसमें सिमिलरिटी है माइको गारो में होता है क्या व्हाट इसे भी बोरो लैंग्वेज में माको कहते हैं so almost very, very similar in our languages. And uh, at this point in time, I would like to congratulate the Boro Sahitya Sabha Committee, the President, General Secretary, for having initiated and had this very, very large and important conference because language is what identifies us. It is our identity as a tribe, as a community. And therefore, the importance of language cannot be measured, I should say. And therefore, seeing the work of the Boro Sahitya Sabha, we all are inspired to see how they have ensured that their language moves ahead, it is nurtured, it is documented, and ensured that uh, these kind of programs will continue to bring out the importance of the Boro language. I would also at this point in time like to inform you, Honorable President Sir, that uh, the state of Meghalaya also has got multiple languages. We had recently passed a resolution in the assembly to include the Garo and the Khasi language in the eighth schedule. And I strongly feel that inclusion of languages of different tribes and different communities will only lead to a stronger integration of this very, very diverse but great nation of ours. Therefore, sir, we look to you also to support us in our endeavor to see that not just Garo and Khasi, but all the different communities and tribes and languages that are there in the Northeast, different tribes, they may be small, but their identity comes from the language and the culture that they have. I urge you, Honorable Sir, that if these languages could be promoted and protected in the long-term interest of the identity of these tribes. My late father, Shri P.A. Sangmaji, was somebody who had a great affinity for the Boro people. Mujhe abhi bhi yaad hai, jab parliament mein wo member of parliament the, to jab Bodo land mein kaafi issues chal rahe the, to late P.A. Sangmaji ne us samay Boro logo ke liye 
और बोडो लैंड के लिए उन्होंने पार्लियामेंट में और लोकसभा में आवाज उठाई थी वो मुझे अभी भी याद है और जो प्यार और जो एक रिस्पेक्ट जो उन्होंने बोडो पीपल की तरफ दिखाया सिमिलरली बोडो लैंड के लोगों ने पीए सांगमा जी के तरफ भी वही रिस्पेक्ट और प्यार दिखाया कुछ ही दिनों में मैं बोडो लैंड यूनिवर्सिटी में जा रहा हूं वहां पे बोडो लैंड यूनिवर्सिटी के स्टाफ ने और वहां मैनेजमेंट ने पीए सांगमा मेमोरियल लेक्चर एक ऑर्गेनाइज किया इसके लिए मैं बोडो लैंड यूनिवर्सिटी के लोगों को मैं धन्यवाद कहना चाहता हूँ वंस अगेन Your presence in a program like this is not just an inspiration to the people of Bodo areas, but it shows your concern and your respect for all the tribes of the Northeast. This sends a very powerful message to the people of the Northeast that as a government and as the president of this country, every single community is important it sends a message that every language that is being spoken throughout the country must be preserved and must be given the due importance and this message will reach every corner of the northeast and once again on behalf of the people of the northeast especially of bodo area I would like to thank you for coming for a very very important function like this.